Hey everyone, welcome to Rosie's Dessert Spot. Today I'll be demonstrating how to create these shortbread cookies using the Gosney Dome. This is a pizza oven that can do a lot more than just pizza, as you'll see. So I've got my unsalted butter in my standing mixer, running it on medium to high speed until it's nice and creamy. You'll want to scrape down the sides of your bowl and your paddle attachment a few times. Let it run till it's pale and creamy and then gradually add in your caster sugar a little bit at a time when it's all nicely incorporated you can scrape down the sides one more time let it run for another minute or so and then add in your vanilla pinch of salt let that combine and then in goes your flour and your cornstarch i'll have the ingredient amounts listed in the description box for you this is also a recipe that will be included in our recipe book coming out hopefully in the next couple of months You'll want to add a little bit of flour onto your work surface and then try to bunch it all together until it forms one uniform ball. But you do not want to knead it. You don't want to activate the gluten in this, so you want to handle it as little as possible. Let it rest for half an hour on your bench top. You can pop it into the fridge if you like to stay there for a few days, or if you're ready to use it, you can start rolling it out. I've got a circular cookie cutter that I'm using and then I'm popping all of my cookies on top of a baking sheet lined with baking paper. You can knead the negative space back into a bowl, roll it out and continue to cut out cookies. Pop them into your freezer for at least an hour or two. I have preheated my oven to 400 degrees Celsius and then allowed it to cool down to 350 degrees. There's a tray sitting on the stone and then the cookies are sitting on that only because the stone will heat up and it could potentially burn the bottom of your cookies. So I do like to elevate when I'm baking cookies. Bake those for six minutes and then turn them around and bake for an additional four minutes. I have the rope sealer door that is on at all times with the vents closed and the chimney is covered as well. After a total of 10 minutes, your cookies should look a little something like this. They cooked through beautifully. They didn't brown too much along the edges, which is awesome. And they tasted delicious. So I hope you guys give this a go. Thank you so much to Gosney for sending us the incredible Gosney Dome pizza oven. If you'd like to check it out, I'll leave a link to the Gosney Dome in the description box below. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. And we'll see you again in the next one.